Hello guys, in this video I'll show you guys how to navigate skylumen.com. So obviously you have to type in skylumen.com and then hit enter in the address bar and it will take you to this uh, home page. Uh, hopefully the first thing you see is the purchase of agreement in red here. Click on the green box. It will take you to this page. Please read everything on this page and agree to everything. After you read all of that, uh, click on this must read and agree to terms of sale before purchase link and then it will bring you to this terms of sale page. Uh, you can download it, print it, read it, or read it as many times as you need. You will have to understand and agree to all of the terms on this page before you can purchase a light. When At checkout, there's a box that asks if you have read this and agreed to everything. So you can even buy a light if you don't check that box and agree to all of the terms okay a physical copy will be in, uh, included with every light purchase so that you can reread it as many times as you want alrighty let's get on with the more fun stuff uh, there's a bunch of different menu here at the top let's click on relevant in relevant you see here at the right box here it says date new to old once you click this drop down box you can arrange all of the items in, in a various different way. By default, all of the items are arranged by uh, from new to old releases. So, as of uh, April 20th, 2018, uh, the Geek VN is my newest release. All right, let's scroll down a little bit and let's click on the OLED M20 as XVN. You notice that the photo is not very sharp. If you click on the photo it will bring a sharper, uh, let's call this the picture viewer and the picture viewer will display a much sharper image. Uh, if you hover to the left and right of the picture viewer you see arrows. If you click on these arrows it will cycle through all of the photos in high resolution. Okay? And then click X to get out. Um, at every sales link there's typically a factory link. Click here. Once you click on this factory link it takes you to the factory link, uh, to the link of the f uh, of the f uh, basically the stock light, okay, the factory link for that specific light. Sometimes the light is completely modded and is nothing like uh, this. All this website really tells you would be the size and the dimensions of the light, the l output, user interface, all of that stuff will not might not be accurate, okay, if the light have an intensive mod. Uh, you I, uh, whenever you see a blue link, you can actually click on it. For example, this light uses driver VN4 UI, so when you click on that, it'll take you to all of the driver page where you'll find driver VN4 here, and here's where you read through the settings. A physical copy will of the UI uh, is included with the light. Um, these bullet points shows the builds, uh, the recommended battery. If you click on the recommended battery, it will take you to the battery and then you can just purchase that battery for the light. At the bottom here, on most modded lights, it will say click here to add V54 engraving. This is where I actually hand engrave V54 onto the light. Okay, click here and then you can add a, an engraving of small, medium, or large size. Okay, if you're unsure, just click on something. I'll find whatever that's appropriate for you. All right, let's click back to relevant. As you can see at the bottom here, there's three pages of light. So there are a lot of different lights. I will make a separate video to go through all the lights and talk about what I recommend and what are my favorites if you're interested. All right. Okay, one menu over is the one-off. Let's click on that. On this page, it shows uh, lights that I particularly have just one sample of, or once in a while I'll have a couple of sample of, but usually there's just one of each. So if it's sold, it's usually gone forever. Like this one-off T21 Ultra Shorty here that uses a polished tail cap, and there's only one of these, all right? Prices, uh, tend to be a tiny bit higher, not always, um, but they're definitely um, not here to stay, okay? Alrighty, let's click on non-light. So if you click on non-light, <laughs> that's just what it is. Batteries, chargers, uh, carabiners, things like that, all the random stuff that doesn't really have anything to do with flashlights, okay? Um, Alright, well batteries have to do with flashlights, but they're not flashlights themselves, so all the miscellaneous stuff that are non-flashlights. 
So let's click on garage sale. I recently added this menu and I think it's pretty fun. Um, some of these lights are modded, some are not. For example, um, this wolf eye seal hunter, this is a stock light. And there are some knives here, some new, some used. Um, like this Mech Army PT1618 here, that's a factory light. SCN7, that's a factory light. There's also, um, uh, um, see right here, if a light says sold out, usually I update, I'm very good at updating the sites, um, uh, and it won't show sold out. I, I'll basically remove it out if it's, um, as soon as it's sold out, but right here I haven't gotten the chance to move it out. But if it says sold out and you click on it, uh, you won't be able to purchase anything. Uh, what else should I say? Oh, again, I've arranged this page to display all the items from new to old releases, so... Uh, every time, I think it's very uh, it's very intuitive that you can come back to the site, click on one of these menu, and you know exactly what I've recently posted up. Okay, um, I update the garage sale page very often because um, there's just a lot of random things in the house that I want to put up for sale. So uh, check out this page; it's pretty fun. Okay, things move rather quick in this page. All right, next menu over the Sarah Cody service. When you click on the Sarah Cody service. Um, it's kind of like a paint, uh, a coloring process for a light, all right. But the paint is baked onto the light, so it's a com, it's a little bit more complex than just spray painting. V a relatively strong paint process, um, but not as strong as anodization. But it's pretty neat if you want your light highly customized. So let's click on this blue B O F G T. You can see that the picture is blurry. If you click on it, you get a sharp image, all right. As shown before, and then you can cycle through the gallery here. Uh, you can see here it's seventy-five dollars for a small size, uh, and then uh, it goes up from there. If you're kind of unsure what size light, anytime you're unsure with anything for that matter, just send me an email. Okay, skylumen.com, uh, skylumen54 at gmail.com, and then uh, you know any questions you have, I'll be more than happy to assist. All right. Click on modding service. I'll talk about, I'll, you know, I'll try to keep everything as simple as possible. So let's skim through this. Um, basically, this is where you want to send in your own light, your personal light for me to mod. And this part right here. Be warned that it's almost always less economical to mail in a light to be modded overall compared to buying the same light directly from me as I buy in bulk. And there's no easier way for me to say that. I hate to give you guys a mod price that seems crazy expensive uh, and you're like hey that's not a lot cheaper than buying a light from your store because I buy in bulk so I get a discount so unless it's a light that you really want to be modded this might not be the most economical route all right next menu over is the driver VN UI when you click on this uh, driver page it has all of the user interface of all of the past and present drivers that have ever been used all right like driver vnx2 here all righty let's go back top to the page and then there's the gallery menu all of the light in this page are either uh, are all sold out you can see an absurd price on everything like ten thousand dollars i just that's just a price for a placeholder all of these lights are sold out they're sold out, and they usually can't be repurchased. But if you really want a light on this page, you never know. Send me an email. Okay, skylumen54 at gmail.com. I might be able to make another one for you. All right? So basically, otherwise, this is more or less just a gallery for you to click on it and just enjoy. It's kind of like an archive. Um, lights that are discontinued, I also drop it in here. Alright, next link over, uh, menu, newsletter, very simple here. Type in your email, hit enter, you will not see anything really, but uh, you be registered onto my email, uh, onto my um, newsletter, okay? Oh, you'll get an email confirmation, remember to reply to it in your email. If you don't get it, check your spam. Uh, next link down here, social network, click on that, and there should be the Facebook page, Facebook Marketplace, Candle Power Forums, and then Instagram. Let's try Instagram. Once you click on Instagram, there is a bunch of lights that I, um, uh, mostly lights, okay? Once in a while, I'll post something that's personal, but, uh, yeah, just lights. Here's my wife. 
Her name is Fu Nguyen, all right? And here <laughs> is the cohort that I and my dad have recently built. My dad and I, okay, all right, let's click back. And then about us, nothing interesting here, just a little info about me. And then if you click on contact us here, you can see that my email is very prominently shown. The reason that I have only shown my email here is because I'm very, very responsive via email. So, uh, any questions, anything, just send me an email and I should reply relatively fast. I would say within 24 hours. It's very, very rare when you send me an email and you don't get a reply within like 24 hours. All right, let's click on, if you click on this logo at the top here, it will take you to my homepage, the front page purchase agreement. The mo likely the most boring page on this site. All right, at the top here you see Luxinifer Balance. Luxinifer is a program uh, that I have. Uh, if you type in here, let, let's ta let's search it up together. Signifer here. Type it in here, and you click on this link. You see that this is kind of like a charity program that I have. Um, lots of detail. Check it out but there is a live balance. Every time you make a donation, I update this balance at the top. And here it shows some of the efforts that we've done with all of the money collected. So we've done a good job. I think we've collected maybe four $5,000 already just from um, uh, customers. So that's that's pretty cool, all right? Let's go back to the home page. Um, once you add an item, let's add an item to your page. Uh, let's add an item to your cart and we'll see so if you click on one of the options here, the prices will change, right? So XPO HI 6500 Kelvin is $200, Nichia 219C 5000 Kelvin $150. If you click Add to Cart, this link will pop up. It will say Continue Shipping on Checkout. Um, you can just ignore it. If you want to, just click on the cart at the top here and it will show you your basket, alright? In this basket, this is a very important box right here. It says Note to Skyloman. This is where you want to put anything that you want to tell me. I read everything. So, uh, engraving placement, uh, a certain color, uh, questions that you have, or just say anything you want. Like, I'm purchasing this light, but I'm really not sure if this is for what my purpose. So, uh, here's what I want. Do you think this light is good? If yes, just ship. If not, please recommend, okay? Or um, anything really. I read everything, so just put it in here. Here's where, uh, here's what I was telling you at the beginning of the page. I agree with the terms and conditions, all right? So, um, terms and conditions, you have to click and agree here, otherwise you can't even purchase. In, there's a bunch of different ways that you can check out, you can pay with credit cards and everything. So, it's a pretty self-explanatory process, all right? There's a search bar here at the top, okay? The, um, it's kind of a, you know, I've been wanting to make this search bar a little bit more intuitive, but for now, uh, the you have to type down something exactly the way it is. Otherwise, you won't get a fine. You won't you won't get, you won't ping up anything. So let's try MT18, and you hit enter. You won't get anything. MT18. See, nothing comes up. You actually have to type in exactly the word that is presented in the title. MT18 VN, and then it'll show. And that's kind of a little. A uh, little of annoyance, but that's what it is. Anyway, it's fun just, you know, scrolling through the r all of the lights anyway. Alright, so that's that. If, um, if there's anything that's unclear, just send me an email. This is a pretty straightforward process. Uh, watch out for my email, okay? In my next, uh, I mean, next video. My next video, I will do the same kind of uh, to, uh, online, uh, how should I say this? Uh... <laughs> What, 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 what do you call this? An online uh, dummy cl class here where I'll show you guys. Uh, not really. Well, what am I saying? Huh, what's that word? You know that one of those times where your mind just shuts off. Anyway, I'll make another video where I'll show you uh, all of the lights in Relevant and what I think or actually recommend it and um, what all that means. All right. Whew, sorry for all that. So much rambling. I can't help it. But that's that. Alright, thank you guys.